The first thing to discuss is that budgets are not bank accounts and they do not assure that funds are available. So what is a budget? A budget is a process to allow control of resources for a specified period of time. We'll call this the fiscal year. It is a formal plan that estimates the probable expenditures and in income from an organ adjacent over that specific period of time. Again, the fiscal year. Then, it allows you to get a good snapshot of all your resources, your income, expenditures, assets, personnel, property, equipment, and debt. You have to consider what is a fiscal year. Most of the time, about 65-70% to 70 of the time, a fiscal year is also the same as a calendar year, going January 1st to December 31st. Sometimes in other organizations, the fiscal year will be different. In a lot of school systems in the United States, the fiscal year is August uh, of one year until the end of July for the next. Um, and then a budget is based on a balance sheet, an income statement, and pro forma. We're going to dive into these a little bit more. Basically, a budget helps describe the overall process of preparing and using a budget your financial statement. Important question to ask is why is this important for a small business? In the small business world budgeting does a lot of things. First it helps you analyze where you can have increases in revenues and decreases in costs. From there you can develop short-term strategies to increase profits and invest for the future. Over a long term you can help you plan strategies to define your overall effort in building a market share and assess the business opportunities available to you and help you exploit those business opportunities whether that is in the short term or the long term. In a world of limited resources, a company must ration its own resources by setting goals and objectives which are reasonably attainable. A company accomplishes this through the quantification of costs and benefits of the activities. In the budget, you need to reflect a clear understanding of past results to get a keen sense of expected future changes. While past results may not always be the perfect predictor, they may flag important events and benchmarks. So the budget period must also be of reasonable length. The shorter the period, the greater need for detail and control mechanisms. The length of the budget period dictates the time limitations for introducing uh, modifications that you may want to be effective. There is computer-aided accounting, and that may help you analyze and report and also furnish managers with comprehensive current real-time results. It may also afford managers the flexibility to test new models and include relevant high-powered charts and tables with relatively little effort. Efficient companies often decentralize the budget process down to the smallest logical level of responsibility. Those responsible for the results take part in the development of their budgets and they learn how activities are interrelated with other segments of the company. Responsible parties use the master budget and their own department budgets for information and guidance. On a regular basis, according to a schedule and in a standardized manner, they compare actual results with their budgets. On a day-to-day -day basis, most managers focus their attention on routine problems. However, in preparing a budget, managers are compelled to consider all aspects of a company's internal activities. The act of making estimates about future economic conditions and about the company's ability to respond to them forces managers to synthesize the external economic environment with their internal goals and objectives. Because the, bu because the budget is a blueprint and a roadmap, it may alert the manager to variations from expectations where there may be a cause for concern. When a red flag is raised, managers can revise their plans. They can change a product mix, revamp an advertising campaign, or maybe even borrow money to cover shortfalls in the budget. The budgeting process demonstrates to managers the interconnectedness of their activities. Budgets provide management with established criteria for quick and easy performance evaluations. Managers, managers may increase activities in one area where, where results are well beyond expectations.